What's up, guys? All right, video number two. I guess I don't have to tell you how many videos I'm uploading. Today, I am doing a review on the Gator Soft Trifold and the Soft Roll-Up uh, tonneau covers. I have both. Don't ask me why I have two Silverados. Long story. But I bought the Trifold first. Uh, and I'll review this first for you, which is actually one of my, uh, not to ruin the video, but this is my favorite of the two. And uh, let's get into it. So as you can see with the soft trifold, it's about the same width as the toolbox, a standard toolbox that your uh, pickup truck will have. Um, obviously, there's a metal bar in here, so you're not going to be able to, to move it too much. The install on this one, however, is much easier. There's a bracket right here that tightens to the lip of the tail, of the bed, all right? And same on the other side. And once you've got it on and it's straight, obviously use the body lines. There's two clips, one on this side, one on the other side. down comes tight so to tighten it and to make sure it doesn't fly away while you're actually driving there are these little clips that go underneath the bed side and you pull it down and it pulls it tight and there's two of them now what I like the most about this uh, tom cover is it's 100% for me personally water uh, we'll drive the family down to Tampa. We'll have a good time. We throw all of our stuff in the back, the coolers, uh, all of our suitcases, our luggage, the kids' dolls. Bang, waterproof. Um, obviously, Gator, is. this is one of the cheaper brands. I think I paid $210 for this uh, tonneau cover. But works as advertised, opens and closes. No problems. Waterproof easy fix for your average pickup truck driver. Tuck. And now to the roll-up. It's the same brand, it's Gator. <laughs> As you can see, I got some water in the back. Oh, there, the pop already came off. This, on the other hand, now has a Velcro. And this installation took me about 15 or 20 minutes. There are these three metal clamps that clamp to the inside of the bed. And they have to be tightened down, but there's still a bit of give to them because there's only so much you can tighten these down before you're really starting to worry about breaking stuff. Uh, this one, the advantage to this, it rolls completely out of the way. Now, of the two trucks, I tend to do more work-related uh, stuff with this one. I, you know, I'll put dirt or concrete, anything. As you can see, the back of this truck is a little more beat up. Uh, this gets everything out of the way. However, this is not 100% waterproof, I've found. There are certain areas of this bed line on the Now, to get this one to completely extend, it's super simple. Besides the 15 minute install, it just rolls out and it clamps in these two locking mechanisms right here. One, two. Obviously, put that in the lip, pull it back, lock it down. Now, it leaks in the back here leaks up front. Here's the second issue with it. If you let somebody borrow your truck, say you let your wife run to the store, or if you tell a buddy, hey, can you go grab something out of the back of my pickup truck? Uh, I have your cooler. And they say, no problem. They open the tailgate, close it, bang. That right there is weather stripping. That weather stripping is what allows us to be semi-waterproof. So every single time I open this tailgate, to pop it, close it, and then, as you can see, it'll get locked. Lock. So the problem is, is when you push this weather stripping down, it, it, it tends to hold a memory. Now, obviously, rubber, heat, Florida weather. It, it wants to be down. Now it's up and out of the way, and a lot of it has to do with clamps that are a very weird design so I want to get in the back of the truck tailgate pop this up 
grab my water, close my tailgate, lock it back down. Uh, another thing I've noticed is the Velcro on the sides. And then, like I said, this is also Gator. This one, on the other hand, is about $179. This locks down with Velcro. It's already right off the bat. You can see an easy failure point right there. One of my stitches goes bad. Velcro. And a pet peeve of mine, I obviously don't want to see wrinkles in my tonneau cover. So I always find myself readjusting the Velcro. Now, when I did open it earlier, I didn't have the Velcro, so it popped and all the way up, which isn't typical. That's typically what you'll have. If you can deal with the inconvenience of slight leakage in the front, where the bulk of your stuff in the middle is not gonna get wet, and if you can deal with constantly having to pop this, and maybe a little bit loose on the, the clamps, then this is the thing. They offer a hard top, that's $500. I don't see the need for a $500 top. This is more of a deterrent than anything. If I can't really see in the bed of your truck, I don't know what I'm cutting into to even try and steal. Most of the time, I don't have anything in the back of the truck, uh, but I would say people don't want to look into it because this already doesn't lock. This is an 05 Silverado. That's a 16, that does lock. But if somebody really wanted into a hard cover, they're gonna break into it regardless. Uh, so my overall review between the two, I would say of the two, this is easier to install, 100% waterproof, closes and opens with no problem. More pricey, but after a year and a half of having both of these, I would say this one is helping better. When the Velcro goes bad on that one, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to upgrade it to the trifold. Now, it doesn't give me the disadvantage of this one. It doesn't give me as much room, but like I said, the installation's easy. I can even take it off and throw it in the back of the cab and ride around with it. So I hope this helped. Uh, if anybody has any questions, please reach out. Feel free to subscribe. I'm gonna produce more videos based on just very simple things. Oil changes, tire rotations, washing cars, waxing, waxing, bursting, ceramic. Um, I just wanna be person that can help anybody do the everyday job that maybe not everybody learned. So like and subscribe, Jake and it easy, and we're out.